Man, this is Chris Cox, founder of The Scar, the South Carolina Adventure Route. How are you, buddy? I'm awesome. I heard there was some rain here last night. Did it was you, a little bit of rain. Did you have any problems in your tent leaking or anything I like that? I didn't have any problems in my tent because I don't have a tent. What do you got here, <laughs> man? Let's see what you got. This is my van. It's a uh, 2019 Promaster and I've built it out into a little camper. Wow. So it's been great. That's cool. Mainly use it for my wife and I to travel around in, but then when I want to haul the bikes, I just throw my utility trailer on the back and bring the bikes. Take the bikes with you. All right. Yeah. Well, can we open it up and take a peek? Yes. Yeah, you don't have any uh, like dancing girls or anything like that in here? <laughs> Nothing like that. <laughs> Not that fancy of a van, I guess. Wow. This is pretty slick, so, man. So you built everything yourself? Yeah, it was just a shell, just a work van. Uh -huh. And uh, still have a little trim work to do, but yeah, it's mostly done, everything functions. So I've got uh, this cabinet here has, you can open it. Shelves for clothing, clothing, it's like our closet. Yeah. Down below I have a pull out composting toilet. Okay. It pulls out on a slider. Okay. And uh, under the sink here, I have microwave, AC, DC fridge. <laughs> and then my electrical panel is back there. Bed is in the back. And I've got the garage underneath the bed, which is where I just throw all my junk. Uh -huh. Sometimes it's more organized than other times. And right now it is kind of You're just in the a middle of pile of junk. Yep. Yeah. Got some more storage back here. Yeah. These seats uh, open up for storage. Very cool. And table swings out and can be mounted here to be used in this chair that, that spins Swivels, around. Yeah. So nice. Yeah, it's still a little bit of a work in progress, but we've pretty, already pretty taken cool. it out west and done some national park exploring in it. And nice. Stuff, so that's pretty cool, man. Yeah. Someday I dream of being able to retrofit a van like this. I think it's so neat. It was definitely more work than I expected. Where did you find all the pieces and parts? Did you have a particular YouTube or, or a website that you used as far as finding out like the blackout shades or, you know? Um, those are WeatherTech shades. They're just made for the van. Okay. And YouTube, I can't point to a, a single YouTuber, but there are, a lot plenty of searches. Of, there are plenty of van life. YouTubers who have converted ProMasters and a lot of them have really good information with, uh -huh. you know, electrical ideas and setup ideas and yeah, YouTube University is, is, way is to go. where it's at for me. <laughs> um, I'm I not an electrician or a plumber by trade or anything. But so. you were able to figure it out. Yeah. Well, that's great. Yeah. I have heard the selection of the ProMaster is important if you want to rate, uh, put your bed this way. The yes, sprinter vans are a little too nor narrow for that. You bet has to go that way. It is the widest. Okay. Yeah, that's a queen mattress in the back. That's cool. And I only had to shave off about six inches, I think, of okay. the mattress to get it to fit in. Impressive. So, uh, yeah, it works great. My wife and I are both fairly short anyway, so I'm 5'9", and she's shorter than me, so. Did you go out riding yesterday? I did. Nice. What part did you do? Yeah, so I'm redoing the scar right now, parts of the scar, because Charleston has been growing so fast yeah. that the original scar is getting sucked into the urban sprawl, and now mm -hmm. some of the scar is going through neighborhoods and by elementary schools and stuff, so. So um, I've got a new section of the scar going around Charleston and I rode that. Nice. Because I had mapped it out and yeah. a couple people have ridden it, but I hadn't ridden it yet. Right. And I wanted to be able to ride it and see it before I published it. So that's what I rode yesterday. And I know a couple of the guys attending the Palmetto ADV rally rode with you. So that yeah. was kind of cool. Yeah, how, it was how a lot have you fun. enjoyed the whole rally? This rally has been phenomenal. Doesn't Shane do a great job? Yeah, he does great. And the venue's good. Um, the the facilities like the shower hot, the shower trailer over there and the toilets they're they're great. I was really surprised the with the showers. Oh my yeah, gosh! Yeah, the food was it, incredible. It helps when the rally organizer is also a restaurant owner. Chef, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You can, cannot complain about the food here at no. all. So. Well, we just loved our little tour of the South Carolina Adventure Route, and we sure thank you for all your efforts. Yeah, and hard well, work thanks for what you guys do. You guys do a lot to put ADV on the map, so we try. We much appreciated. Thanks, man. It's good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Motor.